final non-conference home game of the season for USF. Bulls and undefeated Oklahoma State. Cowgirls were 8-0 coming into this one. Courtney Williams came out on a tear, hitting the first three shots of the game. It was 6-0, about 90 seconds in. Oklahoma State called a quick timeout. Out of the timeout, Cowgirls climbed back into it, went to a 2-3 zone that slowed the Bulls down on offense, and then fed the ball to Brittany Martin, the Big 12's leading scorer, had four of the team's first eight points. Martin did finish with a game-high 19, but it came on 21 shots. Bulls did a good job frustrating her. USF led by by eight at the end of the first quarter. Bulls spread the ball around nicely. Three players in double figures. The team had 19 assists, and Caitlin Weber had a season-high eight points to go along with four rebounds against a very big and tall Oklahoma State lineup. Ten-point lead for USF at the half. One area they did struggle from the three-point line. Both teams did. Oklahoma State an ugly 8% from behind the arc. But a couple of threes for the Bulls in the third. Ferreira knocks one down. Williams knocks one through. Ferreira had 12 of her 14 points in the second half. The 14 tied a season high. And Courtney Williams with an efficient 16 points, 7 rebounds, and 3 assists for the senior. Now, USF shot 52% from the floor in the second half. It was the defense, though, that won the day. Oklahoma State scores its fewest points of the year and shoots just 29% from the floor, their worst of the season. Bulls got tremendous balance. Alicia Jenkins had a game-high 14 rebounds. USF goes on to win 68-46. USF's now 7-0 at home this season. It will be a couple of days before the Bulls are back here, though. Two road games, their next home game back here on January 5th against UCF. With Bulls Cast, I'm Mike Lefko.